What's going on guys, always winner, and today we are playing some Clash of Clans, so you guys will see, um, uh, you guys might remember I got hogs in the laboratory, so getting those up, they'll be done in two days, and uh, I set all five of my builders just about, about maybe two days ago, I set two on these Teslas, and thank you War Eagle for the hog riders, and then I sent one about two days ago on that as well. Just put one yesterday on the air sweeper and the bomb tower. So hopefully we're going to be getting those max very soon. So bomb tower, we can actually go ahead, move straight up here and put them there. And yes, this elixir storage is out of place. And that is because I don't have a builder to remove this bush right here. So kind of, kind of out of luck right there. So we are quite full on loot. I did spend a lot of loot yesterday on this. I spent, what was it, about five, four and a half million Somewhere around there. So spent four and a half million, ended up with about one to one and a half, two million gold. But farm that back up. So that's pretty easy. Um today I don't know what I was gonna do. I was gonna go ahead and actually post a zombie survival. Um but we're last day on earth as you guys know. So I got a comment the other day and it said uh do zombie survival or last day on earth on Saturdays and call it um survival Saturdays. So that is is what I'm gonna do so expect videos on Saturdays coming now and uh, they're gonna be survival Saturdays so we're gonna be doing that and update just dropped for the game and the update is so cool definitely think that update needed to happen and we're gonna um we're gonna go over that on Saturday so it is a few days away and I didn't do one this Saturday but we are definitely gonna start doing that so today kind of just doing whatever we want um I don't know what to do I might just go ahead and do some random stuff. I'm going to go ahead and attack with this go wipe strategy. And then I don't even know what to do next. But all I know is we're maxing out this base very quickly. And uh, let's look at what the home base looks like. And guys, if you go back to my first video and you guys come back to this one, you will see how much we've actually progressed. And it has been fun. And we have progressed a lot. So let's go ahead and let's just head into a battle, you know. And we actually might do some night village battles. To be honest, I don't know what we're doing. So, wow, this guy has a lot of gold. So, you know what? I think we're going to attack this base. So, let's go ahead and play a minion right there. Another, okay, no, we can actually play a minion out, or a uh, wizard. No, we can't. Maybe we can. In the corner? Uh, no, still going to get targeted. Let's place two wizards right there. Hopefully, take almost that out. All right, so, we are on to a good start, sort of. Let's go ahead and play two more wizards right there. Hopefully, do some damage to that one. And, um... Uh, Basically, we're just going for gold. I don't really need elixir. So, let's play golem and let's get some wizards down. And uh, pick off a few of these buildings. And that should get that. And let's go ahead and send in a wall, some wall breakers, not just one. And uh, let's get our king going. Let's get three P.E.K.K.A.s and the rest of the wizards going down. And, uh, guys, this is basically it. So, let's go ahead and rage that one group up. That is a huge... That's a lot of rage troops right there. So let's go ahead. I'm going to heal him just so that Queen does just a little less damage, you know. And I'm going to go ahead and hit him with a rage again once they get in the middle. Let's go ahead and keep them raged up and get them going through this middle section. And if we can grab that Dark Electric, that's going to be great as well. So our King has not really gone hit yet, but we just took out the Town Hall. We're moving along, moving along. Uh, maybe we can get to 50%. I don't know. But here we go. Everything is kind of dying down. We got no spells left. Pekka's are going through the wall. They are getting pretty... They're getting hammered quite well from that... Um, from the bomber. And, uh, wow. We did not grab 50% at all. But I'm going to go ahead and take this. Maybe... Oh, uh, man. We almost stole it. Maybe we can get an archer down, actually. Let's go and play an archer. Nope. Cannon's going to see an archer up there. Cannon's still going to see archer over there. And uh, Cannon still sees it. So, I don't know. Let's go ahead. We are definitely going to snipe this one, though. Actually... Where do we go for dark? We're going to go for elixir. And let's play that. And uh, once they die, let's go ahead. Head out of here. We still end up getting some cups. We get 636,000 gold, 300,000 dark, and about 1,000 dark elixir. So that's a plus in my books. And we're getting close to the max dark elixir point. Can't really spend anything on that. And guys, here's also um, kind of, you know, a redo on my schedule here. So um, I'm definitely going to do... Alright, so Hog Riders are going to max, you guys know that. Minions are one level away from max, and I think I'm doing 
P.E.K.K.A.S or Rage Spell next? You guys let me know which one I should do next down below. Let me know because I do want to start this as soon as Hog Riders are done. So again, tell me what you guys think I should upgrade next in the laboratory. And we're going to get that done. So, now let's go ahead and actually head over here. I have not been over here in about a day or so. So we got a lot of stuff to do. Been upgrading a lot of stuff. Actually got the air defenses or firecrackers to level 5. Got my archer towers both to level 5. Got the Tesla to level 5. Uh, what else? What else? I got the double cannon level 5. Don't know if you guys already saw that. So we are going right along. And uh, both my cannons are level 5. But you guys already know that. So I think today we're just going to go ahead and, you know what? Let's go ahead and find a base. So as you guys saw, I was, you know, kind of jumping around between 1 or 1900 and 2000. And now we're in the 2400s, guys. So let me just tell you guys, all baby dragons. Oh, man, I put those two too close together so all baby dragons guys is definitely worth the uh definitely worth getting because they are super strong i'm just gonna let you know that they are way stronger than you know level nine or level eight because i i honestly don't know why maybe it's because i get two extra i don't know but they are just so much better and uh this one's looking like it could possibly be a three star um nice so we just need a baby dragon over here that's gonna take that out and let's go ahead and play our battle ram right here let's use his ability to get through that wall quicker and hopefully they could take out that firecracker nice and this baby dragon will take out that um that crusher and that's gonna let us get the town hall and there's really only let's see two defenses that can actually really hurt my battle machine and let's use his ability again actually did not see how low his health is getting but this darn um what what do they call this this darn roaster i forgot is uh kind of roasting my baby dragon and my battle ram all together and there goes my baby dragon so let's hit his ability dang i hit it too early and he's only gonna get two swings off on that but nice we are gonna take it out and guys this is gonna end up being a three star for us so hallelujah we are finally actually climbing up in trophies as you guys know from past um past videos we have been actually um quite slow with climbing and we haven't really climbed anything but Hoping to get the 3,000 very soon. That is definitely going to be something good. And, uh, oh man, we have we have things up here. So we're definitely going to get our battle ram back up to 100% health. It's just going to take a few seconds. So I'll meet you guys back at the Night Village base. Alright guys, so we picked up the 100%. 12 baby dragons. I definitely think that extra, you know, one baby dragon per army camp definitely helped a lot. But, Wow, we end up tying with this guy. He got a three star on us as well as we did for him. And I've also been doing a little bit of upgrades in here. As you guys know, I got the baby dragons up and I got the giants up. Nothing too much, but I'm definitely going to try to get the giants maxed out. But let's go ahead, hit our boost, and let's try to get into another one real quick. Um, I'm trying to stay around the 10 minute mark or so for the video just because it's a lot easier on me. And I think it's better to watch shorter videos um, just because... It's, I don't know, it's just super, it's just something about the shorter videos that just makes, it, I know it makes me want to watch them, just because I know it's not going to take up as much time, um, and I could be doing something else. So, uh, today, we're just kind of messing around, like I said before, but we are definitely pulling in, um, some pretty good stuff, I know, like, I like showing the, uh, new stats for, like, the baby dragon and stuff, and dang, I keep putting them way too close together, still got three left, so we got quite a few left, honestly, we need to get one on that archer tower, and, uh, nice, they did come too close, sadly, but I definitely think our battle ram could do some damage if we could take out some defenses, but maybe if we take out that archer tower, we'll be in luck, nice, oh, they're not far enough, you have to be kidding me, but nice. Baby Dragon takes out another defense. We're already at 71% one star, so it's not good enough. But actually, check that out. Baby Dragon swoops and takes that. So we need our... Okay, Battle Ram, what are you doing? Can we just be real? What was that? He should have went for the walls. Like, come on, Battle Ram. So he's going to um, derail off track a bit, and he's going to go around. And uh, two swings for that. That was an absolute waste of an ability, but we'll get it back here soon. Let's go ahead and hit his ability so he doesn't really die to the crusher and takes it out quick. And guys, is this going to be another 3 star for us? I'm thinking so. And also guys, I know I'm super excited for the whole Survival Saturdays. That was definitely a good title from... I'm going to have to find the comment again. But that was definitely a good title from the person. And that's definitely a good idea. Now I know I said in my earlier videos that I'm not doing anything on the weekend. But I... 
I definitely think this is going to be good, and it is a time that I don't have school, homework, any of that, and I can just chill, relax, and make some long videos for you guys, and they're going to be on fun games, so the update, guys, they just released, um, let's go ahead and get into one more, and we keep getting three stars as well, so something's going on, but the update is super awesome, guys, you could now go into people's bases without having to have explosives, so I definitely think that's something very cool, and I definitely think they needed to add that, because... You had to wait till you're like level 84, I think, for explosives to break into somebody's base. How ridiculous is that? Let's go ahead and send in another baby dragon. But we got three up here. What the heck are you guys doing? And uh, let's send one on this army camp. I'm going to go in for that archer tower. Hopefully, nice. There it goes. And yeah, so guys, basically, this is going to be super fun on Saturdays. I definitely think it's going to be bringing in some more traffic to the channel. I definitely think that's going to be cool. And we are at 120 subscribers, so thank you guys so much for that. We are definitely grinding our way up there. And uh, I can't wait for the day we hit 1,000. That will be awesome, guys. So, right here, Baby Dragon's going in on the Crusher. Um, hopefully, he can take that out nice. So, here, we're going to go ahead and go in from down here. And, of course, he's going to walk around for whatever reason he wants. And not just go straight through the wall. When it would be a little easier, I think. But... Uh, let's go ahead, take that out with two hits, I think. Three hits with no health, basically. And, uh, this is gonna be actually a tough one, because that Crusher can stop us, and we still... Okay, please don't hit us, Crusher. Nice. So, right after he takes us out, I'll hit his ability. Walks in towards the Crusher. He's gonna take the Crusher out. Crusher took forever to hit, so that's definitely a bonus for us. And we can actually take this Builder Hall and run away and see peace. And, uh, let's go ahead and hit his ability again, take this out. And let's keep trucking through. Now, we're definitely not getting the 3-star, I do not think, because that Tesla will actually do some pretty good work on him. Let's go ahead and zoom in here. And he's not even going to take out the cannon, I don't think, before he's destroyed. Yeah, so 86% 2-star, still not bad, but we get 3-star twice, so hopefully it didn't happen a third time. And there we go, wrapping up a victory. So, if you guys enjoyed the video today, hit that thumbs up. And if you guys are excited for the Survival Saturdays, also hit the thumbs up. And guys, thank you so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you're out on new to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Peace out.